Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Sulif and this is Sulifin Easy Reacts. We are back to checking out more uh, music from the rock band Metallica. The song is titled uh, Whiskey in the Jar, just official music video. Um, you guys suggested that I check this one out, so uh, we are here. Be sure to stick with me to the end of the video. I'll definitely give my take about it. I hope to see you there. So, without wasting much time, without further ado, Metallica, Whiskey in a Jar. Let's take a listen, guys.
All right, guys. So that was a Metallica with a whiskey in the jar. Yeah, uh, this song, uh, you know, um, is, is a classic, you know, folk inspired you know, rock song, you know, performed by yours truly, uh, Metallica. Yeah, uh, this song you guys already know originally, uh, um, uh, uh, a traditional, you know, folk Irish, you know, folk song. Uh, but I feel like uh, you know Metallica's cover um, of it, you know, was was awesome. You know, I loved it. I definitely loved it. I mean, James Hetfield's uh, distinctive vocals, you know, gave the song a unique and powerful, you know, interpretation. Um, definitely loved how he added, uh, you know, that raw and aggressive edge uh, to the <laughs> to this traditional uh, folk song, you know, and uh, and the lyrics. Um, I mean, I love the fact that he he infused, you know, the song with a, a sense of um, uh, what's the word, uh, rebellion, you know, and defiance, you know. Uh, James Hertzfeld's uh, vocal performance definitely, to me, um, you know, captured uh, the, uh, the character's emotions, you know, as he tells, um, you know, the story, you know, of a highwayman who robs um, um, and ultimately, you know, gets betrayed uh, by his lover, you know, all while, you know, enjoying whiskey. <laughs> Very funny. Uh, yeah, but for the instrumentation, I mean, personally, that was what it did for me. I mean, this 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 uh, Metallica's rendition of uh, the song Whiskey in the Jar definitely maintained uh, the song's, you know, folk roots, you know, whilst infusing it uh, with the uh, heavy metal edge. You know, I loved it. I mean, the band's trademark guitar riffs uh, performed by uh, James Hetfield and Kirk Hermit um, definitely, you know, gave uh, the song a hard hitting sound. Yeah. Also lo loved uh, Lars uh, Urich drumming and uh, Jason, you know, Newstert's uh, 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 bass work. You know, I feel like that uh, provided a solid rhythm, you know, rhythm foundation, if that makes sense. Yeah. Um, I also have to say the song also features, uh, you know, some impressive uh, guitar solos, you know, as is often uh, the, the case with Metallica's uh, covers and original uh, songs. Definitely love the combination of, uh, you know, acoustic and electrical uh, guitar elements, you know, I feel like that created um, dynamic and uh, that dynamic sound that definitely pays homage uh, to the to the um, to the folks uh, origin, you know, whilst adapting it to uh, the, the the band's you know heavy uh, metal style. Yeah, the lyrics you guys already know what the song is all about. The lyrics to me, I feel like tell the story of a highwayman. I already said that you know who becomes entangled, you know, uh, in a love affair, you know, only to be betrayed by his uh, lover. You know, yeah, whilst he's drinking whiskey. <laughs> yeah, but I loved it. I definitely love this rendition by uh, Metallica. You know, shout out to you guys for suggesting I check this one out. Let me know down in the comments section what you think about this song. Let me know what you would like for me to react to next. I'll definitely come to and do for more reactions such as this on the way. So stay tuned. My name is Philip. And until the next music reaction, take care. Stay safe. Peace out.